G'day, Alan here, Makara Boats. Today I wanted to talk to you about one of the major differences of our hulls uh, versus the rest of the aluminium industry. Uh, so there's a lot of boat builders out there that claim to build their hulls to meet Lloyd's special service craft. So I'm going to point out some of the key differences that you'll see in our hulls that no one else is doing. So um, basically a stringer like this, when it meets a watertight bulkhead, so you can see here, this is the um, wheelhouse bulkhead, which in our boats is all watertight. Um, most builders will have their stringer thickness continue through and then they'll put a limber in the bottom of the stringer and they'll only end up with about three blobs of weld because that stringer height there runs through. A Lloyd's requirement is that you maintain your stringer height even when you intersect a frame. So when you intersect a frame you can see there our stringers increase in height to maintain the 70 mil thickness. Another really uh, important feature of a Lloyd's hull is that stringers should always have uh, limber above them. So this round hole here is really important because it prevents uh, impacts on the stringers uh, cracking the frames. Um, obviously a lot of impacts are happening on these stringers when they're supporting the hull plate in a big sea and if you don't have that rounded hole it's got potential to cause cracks to spread through your frames and it's actually a Lloyd special service craft requirement so if you see a boat that has stringers and they don't have a round hole above the frame uh, where it intersects a stringer uh, you know that basically that is a potential cracking area. So if you've got any more questions about hull structure, uh, feel free to get in contact with us, sales at makaraboats.com. You can reach out to me, alan at makaraboats.com, uh, for more info. And uh, yeah, now that you've learned a bit about our hulls and why they're so different to the rest of the aluminium boats on the market, we'd love to see you in one.